morning everybody. I'm now on day two of my weekend away in Dorset. If today is officially the 21st of September. Sorry, I know I've been here for 10 years, but it doesn't feel like I've been here for 10 years. I don't think it's hit me yet. Maybe I cry later because it might make me go. Oh my god, I've lived for 10 years of my life. I've spent my 20s in the UK. That is something I never thought I would do. <laughs> so Today I've started off at Dirtle Door. Dirtle Door is one of my favourite places in the UK. It's so unique and prehistoric and it's just a wonderful feat of Mother Nature. It's stunning. Um, it's not a very popular site, which is quite nice. So you can spend your time enjoying the stroll down and taking in all the greens and the blues and the rock formation. So if you get behind me. This is currently what I'm walking towards. It's absolutely stunning. Now, what's so beautiful about this coastline down in Dorset, it's called the Jurassic Coastline. So it's very prehistoric. The foss fossils have been found, dinosaur bits and bobs. So I've got my little friend today demonstrating this. My next stop for today is Ludworth Cove. I've heard of this place. It's meant to be absolutely stunning. It's just down the road from Dirtle Door, so you can walk from Dirtle Walk. So you can walk from Dirtle Door to here, but I've decided to cheat it and drive. And it is cute coming out of the Wazoo. It's kind of like a little village that they created for tourists as well. There's some nice cafes and shops, and it's a nice little stroll down to the beach. So I'm now walking down to my favourite walking spot in the whole of the land. Um, we discovered this place about eight years ago when we were going film scouting for a location for the short film we were doing. And we had heard about this quarry. And it was used in Doctor Who, John Carter. And they've cut out like a room into this cliff that looks over the water. It's quite a special place and it's definitely a local 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 place to visit. I come down here a lot 
whenever I'm in the area or I have a friend that wants to say something about the UK, I always bring them to this spot. So it's not for everyone, it's just, I don't know, I just love this place. It's got local beer and ciders and the and there's also good parties too. I'm sure. I think there's some chickens walking around, but they're not here today. Anyway, this is a place you must go to. Okay, so we're at the Museum of Natural History and Science. Um, in the distance. I can't believe I'm here. I wanted to come here for such a long time. I'm so excited. Whew.
felt I'm absolutely exhausted after my day. I've walked about 14 kilometers, a little bit of blush from the sunshine today, so I'm definitely getting the last of the summer sun. I'm just starving, and I am going to go and get some fish and chips by the sea. I cannot wait. So this is meant to be the best fish and chips in Swanage, so I'm really excited to see what it tastes like. Thank <laughs> you.